Build the God Squad you've always wanted. InstantMuttCoins.com. Instant delivery, cheapest prices, 24-7 support, use code CC, 15% off. EA tax 10% is covered. Hey, what is going on, Madden family? I'm going to be honest. I know you watched the, the draft video earlier. I know you saw it. Um, and because you saw it, you saw what we had pulled. So uh, that felt really, really lucky. Didn't it? It did. Um, we're going to open 398's worth. It's over a million coins in just the draft packs and see. 140,000, right, is, is, is what we're looking to get back. We're, I'm opening 140,000 in picks for you guys today because I want to see, like, was I just really lucky or is this a thing? So we're going to do it. Uh, for better or worse, uh, 140,000 in picks. A million coins. Gone. Risked. We found the biscuit. R risking it, man. We are risking every little ounce of this biscuit today to see how we can do it. To see if, I mean, okay, it's starting out really good. Uh, is this just is this is this money making scheme right now? Is this coin making scheme? Is the, is it really this good? Uh, maybe it is. Maybe it is. Maybe it's not. Um, like I said before, Justin Pews all day. Uh, when these start, there's so few cards in these sets or these packs that can be pulled that. It feels like the odds are so much better for the high cards. Uh, and as the promo goes on and more cards get put into the packs, uh, it feels harder and harder and harder to consistently pull good cards. So uh, that's why I want to do this today, now. Uh, I'm recording this early, obviously. Uh, and we see, like, we started out with a bang. <laughs> <laughs> this this is going well, but uh, you know I'm risking three ninety eights. Like I said, it cost me, but wow! Well, I mean, we had pulled one, so it's about a million coins total, uh, more like one point one probably, to see what we can do with these, and see if this is a profitable set or or if it's not. I mean, just just because you get. A good pull or a lucky pull doesn't mean that a pack is good or is, or is profitable. Profitable would, maybe this is good, um, profitable would mean consistently profiting, right? Not you only profit. Okay, this is this is really quite it's a good set, in fact, um, apparently. But consistently, and we are hitting pretty consistent in these, I feel like. Uh, definitely this is, ups and some downs with it right but it seems to be pretty good i don't know for how long this will be maybe this will get nerfed maybe it'll be nerfed by the time you watch this so please keep that in mind if you were watching this and, and if you check social media to see if this is still paying out really well okay just just a fair point because whenever we do stuff like this uh when we mention that hey this is doing pretty well by the time you see it maybe it may be later on in the evening maybe tomorrow maybe it's on saturday or sunday you'd be like this doesn't work well okay well the, it worked at the time of the recording for how long ea can nerf these packs or, or change them in, in either way better or worse at any moment because there's no odds on these packs when we're using currencies so uh, you just kind of got to live with that and go with it, essentially, and see how you do. I mean, we have had some really, really good streaks in this and some, I don't know, bad streaks. Marcus Davenport's, Corey Coleman's, Trail Edmonds. There's just a lot of high cards. There's more high cards than there are low cards that you can pull. There's more of them. I'm not saying they're as common. There's just more of them. So the odds can't be that bad. You know, when you're pulling a high card, uh, let's say that, like, 
the uh, the pack out percentage is like from ninety to ninety two, um, and then ninety four plus. Like the chances of getting ninety four and the ninety six then are the same, right? And that's what I mean by there's more chances for you to actually profit back on this. When well, this is hit, this is hit a little cold, and this is natural, and this is probably the way it should be. Like you shouldn't. I mean, you shouldn't hit Marcus Davenport every damn time, but you shouldn't hit the 98s or the 90s even every time because those are all profit. So uh, this seems, I, I, I don't know, I'm still fortunate, still lucky. I feel like I was still lucky with what we pulled. I mean, 140,000 of them and we pulled 198. So, I don't know, it almost feels like they come in waves. Like, this is going to be a high card, right? 86, okay. I feel like they've all come in waves. Like, it was like 96, 94, 92, 92, 98, and then nothing for a little while, right? 85. That went really fast. <laughs> that went really, really fast, didn't it? Holy crap. Uh... I had some other cards in here. I don't want to count them in our total, so I need to find those. I think we started out here. So we made 60,000 picks. I mean, that's pretty good, right? It seems pretty good. Uh, I had these old cards here as well. Let's... Use those picks. These are different picks. So from out of those, we made sixty thousand. Uh, I'm going to take all of our non-profit cards and put them back in as well, uh, and we can roll those. And so from our our good pulls, our ninety pluses, this is what we're sitting at, still profit. So let's re-roll these forty-three thousand we have here. And maybe we can be greater. I mean, this is 10 packs. 10 additional packs. Just, you know, a couple, two 94s, a 96, break even, a, 90, a 98, obviously. These 90s are good. Um, the coin value on these cards is also pretty low right now, too. So you got to keep that in mind when you're opening these. It's not like you've got to get really lucky and do a lot of this and get a lot of picks to make a lot of coins on this, in my opinion. Because those these 98s are not cheap. They're cheaper than MVPs were. Like, that's crazy, right? I bought my... I had to buy two, and I bought them for 350 and 360 for 98. So, not expensive cards... I mean, if you think that's expensive for a 98, okay. MVPs, people would buy for 400 left and right, boom, 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 to get scouts. This is a, is this a cheaper promo, which is good. I'm okay with this. Fun, new. It is the same concept, but it's new, so it feels better. It feels better, 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 better. 88, and uh, one more. So we definitely didn't make our picks back here uh, on, on this set, unless we pull something here. So we didn't. So we'll take those again, the under 90s, and I will re-roll them. And I'll probably just, uh, maybe just hold on to the other stuff, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what I want to do yet, to be completely honest. This card's going to come in handy. This card's going to come in real handy at some point. Because the draft is a long promo. It's a long promo. Some really good stuff could come out. Who knows? Who knows? I don't know. Do you know? Nobody knows. We'd all just be guessing. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, I need... 100 picks. You can't, like, get 100 picks easy. 
Ghost? No. <laughs> there we go. Ghost? 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 Is it a ghost? Did we get a ghost? Let's see how we do here. Last one. I'm doing no more this video. 86. So we had 140,000. We turned it into considerably more. Uh, the exact amount now. Of course. Now we've got all these other cards muddying up what we got. Uh, bah, 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 bah. We turned 140,000 into 191,000 after a couple rerolls. So we definitely we made 300k profit. Good. I think it's pretty good. Uh, let me know what you guys think if you guys are doing this and having luck. Great. Uh, there's a risk involved. I mean, I, I put a million on the table to make 1.3 million. Right. If we don't hit this Adrian Peterson, we don't profit. Just think about that. Despite all of the other stuff we pulled, if we don't pull that AP, we don't profit, okay? Can you make coins on it? Yes. Are you guaranteed to make coins on it? No. Fair? Fair. I'm out.